C really likes to know the size of things. If you don't believe me, check this out. The size of an int is 4, the size of a double is 8. So why should we care? Imagine if we want to malloc a few bytes. How do we know for sure we allocate enough bytes for at least one integer? Well, according to the standard, we don't. The compiler is free to set the maximum size of most data types. So in our example, it's possible that we allocate enough bytes for a single integer or even two or even none, depending on our compiler. To make sure we allocate enough bytes, we have to use the size of operator like this. This will guarantee that no matter which compiler we're using, we will allocate enough bytes for at least one integer. If we wanted to allocate enough bytes for an array of five integers, we could do something like this. Here we're multiplying the size of int, which in our system is exactly four by the number five. This will give us enough bytes to fit five integers in memory. We can also use this trick to get the number of elements in an array. So for example, if we declare an array and run the size of operator, we will get 40, assuming our compiler uses four bytes for our integers. Now, to get the number of integers that array actually holds space for, we can run size of x divided by size of int. This gives us exactly 10, which is exactly how many integers we can fit in this array. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure you check out the playlist on the screen right now.